Joan is literally fire. And like she's got I mean she's very she's like one of those one of the most like dynamic people that I've ever met. So I didn't know how to. Do, I was like, I'm not a performer. I'm an actor. I, you know, so under I, I could sort of hide behind behind her and play a rock star. And I would normally never do that. I thought it was really uh, incredible. I was very grateful that um, that the casting was such as I, I was able to work with such an authentic ast actress. You know, she really nailed it. It was amazing getting to play this incredible woman and uh, getting to portray this story, um, a story that I think a lot of people don't know about. And um, I was really happy that I got to, to um, bring it to life. Dakota is my favorite actress of all time. And, and literally, when I found out that she was going to be playing me, my knees buckled. It was the happiest day of my life. We didn't have a lot of time before the movie started. We met. Uh, for a night on New Year's Eve last year, and then we had about three weeks before filming started, and we had to do a lot. We had to record, we had to rehearse, and sort of discuss the script. So uh, it, it was, uh, we did a lot of cramming. There's only so much that you can get from photos and footage and online, just stuff that you can dig up. Uh, to really capture someone's essence, I mean, um, I, it's, it's nothing that you can ever claim. I mean, I don't know if I have. I, I feel like I've gotten to know Joan really well, and I, I care about her, like, I mean, at least in this context, more than anything. And um, I, I, I don't know. It's just sort of one of those things. You're driven to do something, and you do anything for it. And yeah. They were truly the first all-girl rock and roll band, and um, a lot of people don't realize that. I didn't even realize that. So uh, I was really surprised and, and happy to bring it to a new generation. I think the movie uh, is a movie uh, that insists that you follow your dreams. You know, it's about, I know that sounds cliche, but too many times I think people belittle our dreams, whether you're talking about rock and roll or you're talking about being a scientist. I think um, you just have to fight for what you want to do in life and not let other people think that. Isn't it funny? I mean, we birthed all of mankind, and they still don't think we're good enough, even to play rock and roll. Well, the whole thing's all done because of Cherie. I mean, not only writing the book, but uh, pushing for it all these years, working to get it to get it done. So everything is due to her, I think. So I think it's wonderful. Oh, I'm really excited. I haven't seen it yet. I, I can't wait to see it. It's been, a, yeah, it's been a long time. So I think I should probably be able to see it soon. Yeah, I was lucky that I got to be in the third one as well, and um, it's such a great phenomenon and a franchise, and I'm really happy to be a part of it. You know, it's a day to day. It's day to day. I miss her very much. If that's what you're asking me about, I miss her very much. I missed her at the Academy Awards. You know what I mean. But uh, she's watching. She's laughing.